Hi, welcome. You're going to be making a simple apple catch game in under five minutes. Right, so you're going to want the apple and bowl sprite from the juice sprite. They they can, they are on the food category. So make sure you go and hit those. Pause and do that. Once you've done that, you're going to go on the apple. When a flag clicked, you are going to hide the sprite. And um, forever. We're going to create a clone of myself. And we're going to get the weight block. Just go control in. And now we're also going to go and for the bowl. All you're going to want to do is and flag clicked forever. Um, but I prefer this set Y to mouse Y. Now, if you do this, as you can see, the apple. Kind of go like that. Uh, oh yeah, that's Y position. Just do mouse X and change the set Y to a, uh, a set X. See so how much you've got set X to mouse X. And set Y to minus 100. You should have this and you can move it left and right. Try and catch the apples. Us. So yeah, now we're going to go on to the apple sprite, and yeah, we've done this, I'm just going to go, when I start as clone, go to Y200, and X, uh, pick random, Um, minus 150 to 150. And I'm also going to want to show. And repeat until my position is less than. Um, what's the bowl? The bowl is negative 100, so we'll just do 150. We are going to change y by negative 10. Maybe not 10, maybe 7. Now, if I try that, they're doing that. But, oh yeah, we need to change this to negative 150. They are dropping down. Maybe set this a bit higher. To what you want, but that will work. Minus 80, and then maybe 130. Oh yeah, sorry, we can do 150, we just have to delete the clone after, don't we? So, if you try this, oh yeah, also, you have to put an if statement in the repeat until. And go, um, make sure you show this variable. And then over here, make it a large readout. And up here. And then you can go, when I click, set it to zero. If... Change by one, and the if statement can be touching the ball. Now I'll try this. We have a simple apple catch game in Scratch, and if you want, you can make them swarm quicker, and you can choose any backdrop you want. Or if you want, you can uh, go to fill, bitmap, and then you can fill the background with this color is. You can like, make it gradient. Or you, could, you could make it like this. If you wanted to. And then try this. And voila. Apple catch game in Scratch.
in if I check. Yeah, it's the five minute mark. So if if this helped you and you enjoyed and you used it, please subscribe, like and comment and I'll show you what to do. So yeah, thanks for watching and bye.